Welcome to Riverbend Talon on WBGZ. Brought to you by the Help and Music Company. Brought to you by the Help and Music Company and by Mr. Matt Van Voorhis of uh, Riverbend Records. RS, uh, what do you call it? Initials Day. Um, record Day. That's I don't need initials. Record Day. Yeah. There, there I am. This I, weekend, I right? Saturday. Myself. Yeah, so uh, there you go. Matt Van Voorhis wants us to give a shout out to Riverbend Records. All his friends. <laughs> Every week, which is a lot of people, so I don't, yeah. I don't think we can cover them. All. Uh, yeah, no. it, it's an endless list. So there you go. But thanks to him and Halpin for, you know, supporting almost this. Probably ten years of this now. Yeah, has it been that long? It's been a long time. It's, it's closing in. Ah, closing in. Ah, jeez. Closing, oh, closing in. Ah, you know what's closing in? What's well, closing in? The she- sea shanty sing along. <laughs> It's, it's well, already underway. Right. Yeah, that too, for sure. Right. That's that is uh that is already going down. People are already drunk on Irish whiskey and and singing. So there you go. Cash Goten, he's uh underway already. George's local brew. Yep, in that's Jerseyville. it. There you go. They're gonna be back to doing the outside shows there soon. I'm sure. Mo Pleasure. You know Mo. I I know Mo. He knows Patrick. Give me Mo. Give me Mo. Yeah, Mo Pleasure down at Patrick's in Granite City tonight, 6 to 9 p.m. Speaking of Patrick, reminds me of Patrick Reddix. Does that name ring a bell? No. He's a friend of a guy named Phil Lesh. All right. Oh, yeah, there we go. Which, for some reason, makes me think of Waldo. Sit down, Waldo. Where's Waldo? Well, they sat on the wall. That's how they became the Waldos. Yeah, I, I'm. Uh, is all I, this ringing a bell? It, it because is, you know, it, it is ringing a bell. Honestly, and, and I don't first, even use code anymore. I, I'm sitting it's there legal trying, now, so why use a code? But I'm sitting there trying. Everyone to Everyone smoke weed. I'm you sitting, don't even need this day anymore. I. I'm, what we need to be celebrating is yesterday. All right. Because that's not legal yet. That was Bicycle Day. That's right. <laughs> that has way more significance. So from now on, we celebrate 419 until, you know. Albert Hoffman's right. legendary bicycle ride. 420s, uh, you know, it's kind of like amateur night now. I, 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 you know it, what I mean? It was a code, so yeah, it made yeah. sense then. But and, now, and, you know. And as you're saying it all, I kept looking at this list going, who's he trying to promote? <laughs> my, 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 my. Uh, Patrick Reddix like, was a Waldo. Yeah. He was the friend of Phil Lesh. And uh, so the story is, right, they are all in high school, the Waldos. They sat on a wall, goofed off, made jokes. And then after school, they met. And they were That's, they had a map, right? This is one story. There's so many of these stories that you Well, hear, this though. is official. I, 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 I don't know how. We I got don't letters know from uh, Phil Lesh, and we've got, yeah. you know, I don't, connections but I, I think to there's the four. Those. I think there's 420 references before uh, 71 when supposedly oh, in San okay. Rafael, Ran, Rafael okay. California, all this happened. Well, I'm see, that's why saying. we just skip it, and we know what happened yeah. on 419. There's no question. <laughs> You see what I mean? It's been a big fakery the whole time. It's it. They they just delayed it one day. Would you actually get a map from the Coast Guard for I, I, a, a marijuana field? I well, I don't know why you wouldn't. If if they'd give you one, why would they give you one? Like I say, there there's a lot of different stories about this though. The yeah. the 1971 from San Rafael was the college students that met at 420 every that's day. That's 19. School. That's what I'm talking about. The Waldos. Yeah. Well, and they. That's but, what I'm but, talking about, but the Waldos. You, but the whole they met at 420 because football I, practice let out at 4 o'clock. But the, ref, the 420 references That's 1971, though. I'm confused. 71. That, that's, that's what I'm talking about, 1971. Uh, so is there two 1971s? There's at least three of them. Because I'm celebrating if you believe in the multiverse, I believe in the multiverse, so there's just endless 1971s. I'm going with 419, I'm just saying. <laughs> there's, no, there's no connection to the short mustache guy that way. All right. And uh, 
Who doesn't like riding bicycles? All right, so, so now I, I it, 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 as you as you led into that, I kept going, what what gig is he trying? I'm I'm flipping through your pages that you've handed me, going, what is he trying to promote here? And now I get it. The yeah. 419 is better than 420. I get I yeah. get the gist of the yeah. story. Yeah. All right. Uh, what else is happening tonight? Because I know we it's got, confusing. We got guests to get to here that are yeah that 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 are that are making me nervous. Mainly Justin Level. Well, I think I hit the well, six waiting. Oh, yeah. I know. It's it. Your 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 energy is. He is. You're bouncing a lot. He is yeah, waiting. Well, he's in. Call me in here to talk about things. <laughs> <laughs> waiting for you to get done yapping. <laughs> He could always say things it? so I could understand them. Listen. Very confusing, Dad. Listen, you and the whole world is waiting for me to stop. Yeah, yeah. I guess, I guess. it's never happened. It's not going to happen. Uh, I, I stopped to follow that story for a minute. I want it, it, to it, ride my bicycle. I want to <laughs> ride my bicycle. <laughs> Justin's uh, not a fan, apparently. So here we go. I'm going to introduce... Oh, I love the song. I'm just not a fan of bicycling. That's oh. what I thought, yeah. I don't like physical activity, if you didn't know that about me. Fair enough. Like, I'm sweating profusely right now, just standing inside. Just, so just from walking Riding a bike in. is not fun. But but National Bicycle Day is, yeah, is, is about more thing. than just riding <laughs> a bike. It's, it's the day that Albert Hoffman took his bicycle ride, the day that... He invented LSD. He fell off his bike, actually. Oh, and rode right, home okay. on a bicycle. Okay. And that, that has now become National Bicycle Day. Well, so well, 419 is important, not so. 420. 420 is old yeah, news. That's a code for hiding. You know, we don't hide no more. <laughs> we we, don't, we don't. Everyone smokes weed and, you know, get used to it. <laughs> now if we could get people to, like, hire stoners and stop, you know, making them pass a test... One the workforce it's, it's coming. It's the coming. workforce will be reloaded cuz uh, anybody knows that's done construction stoners work hard at building things <laughs> uh, like bongs oh yeah well I need a coconut a and a snorkel <laughs> and a 5 8 wrench <laughs> Uh, that, that's the voice of Josh Witt. Yeah. What's we, up, y'all? <laughs> we, we've got Josh and Andrew from Spilly Nelson hey, also hey. in the studio. Yeah, yeah. It is a full house, indeed. Oh, wow. That one made me laugh. The, the coconut. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's true, though. You can make a bong out of any. It's like, I, I, I once made one out of a dead squirrel, you know? <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. Uh, you had to freeze it, you know, but it was. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Did it taste kind of nutty? Yeah. <laughs> well, only because of where I put the mouthpiece. That's right. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. It's early in the show for jokes like that, man. <laughs> you guys are I, it, that, that, it was by his mouth where he had the acorns. <laughs> Justin, come on. It was by his mouth where he kept oh. the acorns. What, okay. What do you... Ah, this is a family show, bro. Keep it out yeah, of the you're gutter. You're right. You're right. Keep it it's, out of the gutter. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> ah, jeez almighty. I'm sorry, that was Justin Level, people. If, if all complaints can be sent straight to justinlevel.com. <laughs> yes, my personal website, justinlevel.com. Send your complaints there. They will be looked at immediately. Yeah. No, we take them very seriously. He has a team of secretaries answering the phone for him. <laughs> Justin, I was just trying to get you ready for trivia night. Oh, well, I'm terrible at trivia. Well, so I'm helping. Help. So you know what happened on 419 now? I do now, yes. So we were talking about this group, the Waldos, 420, <laughs> which we're debating because there's like 100 different ways. This, uh, to, supposedly, to leave your they, lover. They, got a, they got a map <laughs> yeah. to look for a, a pot field, and they'd meet at the statue after school at 420. And then they just happened to become friends with the Grateful Dead. <laughs> You know, yeah, because the Coast Guard introduced him. Yeah, actually, it was uh, <laughs> one of their dads was a real estate agent, and he uh, he met the dead, and and then they ended up house setting and dog setting for the dead before they became roadies. And then they had this code, so they'd talk about it all the time, and then it became a sticker. <laughs> it became a sticker, <laughs> right? Remember the sticker? <laughs> was it like when the happy face uh, son, son, uh, showed up on the on the yeah. on Forrest Gump? You know, oh yeah, the mud yeah. washed off, and it was a happy face. Oh, when he face. wiped his shirt on his face, <laughs> yeah, yeah. and it was that perfect smiley yeah, face somehow. Yeah, and then there oh, the that, smiley face. You act like that born. couldn't happen. But, okay. <laughs> So it's yeah. Hollywood magic, baby. <laughs> 1971, which you pointed out several times. And I, I, so did I. <laughs> so there's several 1971s right. in my world, just yeah. so you know. 
interesting, uh, though, to me is that these guys, the Waldos, who were a group of guys that hung out on a wall and just told jokes and cut people down. And, you know, that's what he did in 1971. Anyways, they've got letters where they'd send them back and forth. You know, the guys that were on tour and the guys that were back home talking this code, 420, and they've stored all these letters in an underground vault. So they're serious about protecting... (laughs) The 420 <laughs> secret. Right. Is it a time oh, capsule? Gosh. They're going right. to dig it up oh, like gosh. 2045. I look, guess look they don't. It's just terrible you know, weed. Look at the, like, yeah. <laughs> just weed in a bag. Yeah. It's all stems and seeds, man. Yeah. <laughs> so they got a vape uh, shop now. Some of the guys have started because they made no money off 420. And uh, <laughs> But they eventually, like, you're right. Not even off the stickers? No. <laughs> no. Those got mass produced it's by like, Walmart. It's like all art. You make it, and it goes out there, oh art, and it's just art after that. You know? No one makes money at this stuff. That's thought? why we have to talk about it every week and say support it, right? Wowzers. Anyway. I'm dizzy. <laughs> I'm dizzy. I'm not sure I, why. I got to tell you the, the final thing, though. So they start this vape shop, right, in 2018. Trying to finally uh, capitalize off this. Hold on, do it. Can I guess? They get sued for putting 420 on the side. No, <laughs> they actually donate all their money to the Drug Policy Alliance. So, like, to get rid of the drug war. Ah, so everything okay. they make off the bait, they donate. Now oh. that's righteous. Just there saying. Yeah. They're doing it for a cause. Yeah, yeah. See, they also gave the stickers away. If they would have kept money from the stickers, they'd have more money to help Nat and I. That's, I a, no, that's I the first time I remember I know none of this. being I think they should the whole up. idea, yeah. man, because, you know. Uh, I don't know how many Volkswagen bugs so, I've seen with I Swerve at 420 on, on it. <laughs> right? Uh, I don't have that one. I do have one that says, look busy, Jesus is coming on the back of my Volkswagen. No, I don't know. Really? About it. All right. Is he coming on 420? I don't, that's, that is a question you'll only have be asked on trivia night. They're going to be asking that at trivia night tonight if we keep at the conservatory. Going, it'll, it'll be started soon uh, if we so keep going. Tonight is trivia night at the conservatory. It sure is, hosted and, by Damian Pickens. Right. And, yes. and that's uh, been going on every Thursday for... It has been. I think we're on our sixth week, maybe, sixth maybe seventh. seventh. Yeah. I don't really pay attention anymore. Yeah. <laughs> it all melts. It all just it just yeah, it just melts together, together if you're doing it right. It's just one long day. It's still 2020, right? It's 1971. It, okay. It's still 420. I don't know about 2020. Hey, you've been having a great day so far. Yeah, How about you, fellas? I had a pretty good <laughs> whatever this was. <laughs> Four nineteen. Get it was all better, melds together. Yeah. But yes, uh, every uh, Thursday, seven thirty to nine thirty. Uh, we've got our trivia nights hosted by Damien. Uh, we are starting this month. The last uh, Thursday is going to be a themed night. We haven't chosen the theme for this month yet, but there's going to be a theme every month. It's free to play. Uh, the winning two teams, um, first place gets a $25 gift card. Second place gets a $10 gift card. Usually they just use it for tabs, which is right. totally fine with me. <laughs> but uh, free to play. It's a great time. Uh, we go through a lot of different types of uh of questions and subjects it's uh it's a nice time so probably it's free to play swing by cheech and chong trivia tonight possibly Uh, there's going to be a lot of marijuana related questions tonight yes 1971 (laughs) i gave you the answer okay well thank you waldo's which 71 was it again i don't know which 71 you were talking about but (laughs) 1692 oh that's too many numbers i'm confused I'm just confused. Columbus now. sailed the ocean blue. Uh, I thought it was 1492. Was okay, maybe it's. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, was the, it was 1972. Which 1692 but. was it? <laughs> <laughs> See, this guy See, gets it. That, yeah. <laughs> That was a setup, uh, Pigpen. You didn't know that? I, I set him up. There's been too many numbers, and now I feel like someone's listening to us. Because somehow a magical number was, was spouted accidentally, and now they're tuned in. I'm I got saying. another number 1055. That 1055 <laughs> is going to be playing from 7 to 11 at Fast Eddie's tonight. Yeah. <laughs> that much Are we doing know. math? 1055. Is that a band? That's the band. Okay, so Rainy Day Woman 12. And 35. And Rainy Day Woman 35 times each other. Is 420. Is 420. Yeah. 
And in Frankie, so there's some more math. And in Frankie Lee and Judas Priest, he says four and twenty windows yeah. and a woman's face in every one. Was that 1971 though? 1967. Rocky Harrison ah. at Thirteenth Floor Elevator says no. four and twenty burns in my heart. Okay, that's two plus 1967. Two now we're getting down. <laughs> now I got him going. I needed to get him going, man. I I I pre-gamed a little too much. Yeah. I just well, I, now I've just got numbers in my head. <sighs> pre-game is code. It's, code. it's 420. Yeah. So that's the new 420 <laughs> sticker is pregame. Oh, yeah. I, I, somebody else made stickers already, so I'm not going to get any oh, money off man. of it. I guess they already did a safety <laughs> meeting too, right? <laughs> classic. So classic. Confused. Classic. Oh, my gosh. Whew, so there you go. So Rewind's I, underway at Big Daddy's in Edwardsville. Big Daddy's. There so, you go. Just to back up. <laughs> to, to back it up just a bit. Uh, anything else going on? on uh, we got guests. Spilly Nelson. Did we mention Spilly What's Nelson? Hey, hey. We mentioned Spilly <laughs> Nelson. And did we here. mention Justin Level from oh. the Conservatory? Hello. Which is why he doesn't know trivia, but he knows it's trivia night. <laughs> yep. Yep. Uh, hey, that's hard enough. Believe me, it is. I, to know that it's Thursday is hard sometimes. Well, four nineteen on four nineteen, oh, it was open mic with Spilly Nelson night at the Conservatory. Oh, it was. Yes. Uh, yeah. Yep. Over a year, over a year running now. We've and celebration doing. of Bicycle Day, of course. Yep. Yeah, and and that every, that every hump day that you guys are down every there, hump day, every hump day yep. you're down yep. there humping it. Uh, it. It's called the midweek break. <laughs> the midweek break, and it, and uh, it's it's an open mic night, uh, a string thing open mic. Yep. Night. Brought to you by uh, Alt Music Exchange and Pi Saw Body Art Tattoos, and Neighbors. also the Conservatory. Yeah. It's just a row and of then, buildings, right? And then yeah. hosted by Spilly Nelson, yeah. where they bring the equipment. So, if you've got a band and you just want to come down and jam, uh, and you don't want to bring no drums and no guitars, uh, we showed up uh, a few weeks ago. I, I didn't have nothing. I played your guitar. I played somebody's guitar. I didn't yeah. even know. Somebody handed me a nice guitar. I'm like, oh, this is way better than mine. <laughs> well, it wasn't me then. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Uh, so anybody, you know, and, and uh, even if you're not a band, you just want to play some songs. That's right. We've uh, got comedy. We've, we've had uh, there you go. we've had some some beatboxers and some folk singers. Folk singers. And, Why are right? you guys beating Justin up dogs? Just behind the bar. Didn't you say yep. he just beat a boxer? Maybe it was a, like he boxed a Muhammad beater. Ali. He boxed a beater. I, I'm not sure. Hey, is uh, Bongo I had a friend box beaterman? Is Bongo Jack? <laughs> is he a beatbox him? guy? No, he's a, well. Yeah, I mean, maybe he does a lot of stuff. Loop loops, uh, percussion, right. and guitar. And, right. And, he jammed with Jay Life today. Yeah. Oh, yeah nice. At uh, the Stoner Supply Company. Man, there's probably a lot of little pop-up shows everywhere. And why, yeah, that was in Whitehall. Oh yeah, it's quite a s- hall. Quite a hall to Whitehall, but that's all right because when you get there, the Stoner Supply Company is right. where you're heading. That you're... ended at five, though. So. Yeah, man, they got everything. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Stone Depot. <laughs> uh, oh, right. Uh, that one killed. Uh, that one killed. Oh gosh, well, it's because it was. Funny. I get jokes. <laughs> or right across the street, stones. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, Josh Witt, everybody. The yeah, wit yeah. of Josh Witt. <laughs> don't, for, don't forget, I do have a day job. <laughs> uh, anything else happening on this fine evening? Oh, I'm sure we missed some stuff. Uh, like the open mic later at Raging Cajun on every Thursday night. Yeah. The uh, LCC concert choir is jamming with Porch Cafe. All right. Nice. I'm not sure how that goes down. But... <gasps> it's yeah. a good band. I think we're getting a... We had some kind of interruption there. I, hear, I, heard, I heard a... Buzz. That, I thought Probably we had some, a call. Like, Probably something to do, do with the button. storms. I hit this call button. Oh, yeah. That, out there. Yeah, you can't hit that button, man. Is that it? Maybe that's it. No, you did it. You don't button. even... Yeah, it's, okay. it's turning some, a light off in someone's house in Germany every oh, time you do that. And they don't even know why. Old kind of high bro. I guess we should keep an eye on this guy. I, gee, he's just randomly pushing buttons. Hey, it no, says cough. Yeah, I know. That's to make yourself cough. Watch. <coughs> See, wow. wow. <laughs> nice demonstration. Right. The TB one gives you tuberculosis, so don't hit that. <laughs> that will be a question at Trivia Night tonight. What? <laughs> 
<laughs> at the conservatory. A little insider there. <laughs> that and what is the uh, cough button? If you're listening, uh, it's not cheating to take these answers no. and use them for later. No, it's advantage. Yeah. If you're a listener, you get that advantage. Right. All right. Spoiler alert. I already know they're going to be asking that. No. Uh, Those listening in know oh that they find gosh. out what's going on around the river bend <laughs> on Thursday nights. It's all in code, but it's told on a thing called a radio. All right, there you go, and 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 we have told you everything going on Thursday night. Now I think I don't, we? Think I don't so. know. No, no? we all didn't right. mention Eric Lysot, your buddy. Oh, he's there down you at Deutz, down at Deutz Village Inn, and we I got that place, uh, we got uh, uh, yeah. residency right. getting ready to start at Deutz Village Inn, correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, got, we got a residency at Deutz Village Inn and at Prairie Inn in Dorsey. Yeah, that's another cool place. They just uh, built yeah, a new stage. They did build a new a stage. Nice one. Electric everywhere. Oh, yeah. Electric up front for lights. Load like in, it. load out door on the back <laughs> yeah, side of it. Yeah, it's really nice. It's nice. Midwest nice. Avenue, and they have great right food now. as well. Great uh, food with Midwest Avenue until 9. So, yeah, next Friday, the 28th, we'll be at Deutz. Um, and then our Prairie Inn show is going to be May 7th. There you go. And that's a 2 to 6 show Sunday. Come get you some lunch, hang out, have a few drinks. Oh, yeah. Bring your kids golf friendly. cart. Bring it's your golf cart. Too, so. <laughs> that's my favorite. Yeah, device. you can. There's quite a few right. guys that show up with their golf carts and their side-by-sides. Yeah. That's a reason to go. There you go. Right there, just to see the golf carts. They ought to decorate them, I'm just saying. Which which one's that? Prairie Inn has the golf yeah, carts? Yeah. All right, there you go. And that's in Dorsey. Yeah. Dorsey. So what about the new place in Collinsville? You guys gonna play down there at the uh at the uh, old Herald Brewery? Have you seen that little setup they got going? No. Oh, oh it's interesting. Man, uh, little balcony, outdoor you, uh, place, outdoor stage. Uh they got concerts set up all summer long, almost every night of the week. So cool to see something yeah. down in Collinsville tonight. Remind it's, uh, me after the show, and I, if you want, I could probably hook you up with a Thursday uh, gig. My buddy Jimmy G had just texted me some dates okay. the other day. Cool, man. And said, hey, you know what? We like want playing to play music. The, yeah. <laughs> this is what it's about, man. Making some sounds. Yeah, yeah right on. It, it's, uh, but they, yeah, they've totally revamped that place. Yeah, and uh, some interesting info we'll get to in a little while on how they're booking some of their shows. I know you guys are all into that stuff. Oh, yeah. And it's interesting what they're doing. I, I'm not so sure they get it, but we'll see what happens. Who knows? Yeah. Uh, we will find out. It's going to be interesting. Jared Lutz down there tonight. And uh, I think they're doing an open mic on, like, Tuesday night, some weird night down there. So it might yeah. be a night to go down and check it out. Where is that place located at? Uh, old Harold Brewery. It's in the Old Harold Brewery. I'm not sure it's where that's Collinsville. at. It's yeah. That is a Collinsville. Yeah, and I don't know the roads over there very well. Yeah. I'm from Collinsville. I don't recall where the brewery is at. That's so why I thought you might know about it. Yeah, dang it. Yes. A I lot did. of the loops. So, so they, uh, they, they've got, like, a... A whole outdoor area that they've yep. that they've redone by the mm-hmm. old brewery where it's like an outdoor uh, amphitheater or whatever. Some and VIP seating that goes with dinner and stuff like that, and then like a balcony area and uh, bring your lawn chair, free area. So I like that part. Yeah, yeah. Free. So uh, there you yeah. Go. Also, Miners Theater. You know where that's at in Collins. Yes, I do. Oh, so yeah. that, that place has been rebuilt. And they got a show uh, uh, this weekend, people. too. Yeah. yeah. No kidding. Yeah, yeah. I remember Just, going watching movies there when I was a kid. Man. I, I remember it was open for a minute in like the late 80s, early 90s. And, and it was, uh, we did a couple shows. It was a huge stage at that time. It was, a, you know, it was like, whoa, this is way bigger than you know, the bars that right. you used to be in. And, uh, Crocodile yeah. Kings will be playing their their uh, second show there. I think they're going to be our guests next week. Yeah, Crocodile so there you go. Kings. Yeah, not to be confused with Cottonmouth right. Kings. Which oh, you would oh. say that. You <laughs> evil. You set me up. Yeah, I know. Uh, yeah, I'd Crocodile that. Kings will be here next week talking to us. So reminds me of the Green Jello story. Remember Green Jello? Of course. We actually the... opened up for them one time. Nice. The See how I did that? that I knew that's that. Awesome. No, I didn't. <laughs> That's awesome. Really? Spilly Nelson? No, Green Bare Knuckle, no. my old band, the metal oh, okay. band we were in. And oh, okay. In fact, Andrew was in it with us. Uh, okay. Bare Knuckle Conflict. We opened up for Green Jelly. Well, it was Green Jelly because they couldn't use right. Jello they, anymore. They, they, see, I, I still got the original video that says Green Jello on right. it. Right. Right. Uh, because they were the first band to ever release a full length video before an album. 
they released that whole hour, like their mm. whole album on video. Yeah, I remember that. Before. It was all that claymation stuff. I, it was, yeah. Well, there was a lot of claymation. I was going to say, there's, yeah. there's a couple of claymation ones, and then there, man, there's some, some pretty Not good Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Yep, yeah. The three little yeah. pigs. Yeah. I like the serial killer But one. they had to change their name because Jello right. actually trademarked Green yeah. Jello. Yeah. Can you imagine what they got out of Green Jello? They probably didn't have any money. Here's Jello. That, that, that's <laughs> you know. why they just changed their name to Jelly. They're like, we got no money. We'll just change our name. Sorry, we don't know what yeah. to do. That's exactly what he did. And he put two dots over one of the letters, so it actually means Jello in like a different language or something that's like that. Dutch. I don't know. Maybe that's Dutch. all made up too. Uh, I'm, I'm making up the Dutch part Is for sure. Deutsch? <laughs> Deutsch. Specken Sie Deutsch. More trivia for trivia night tonight at the conservatory. Yeah. Mm-hmm. There you go. <laughs> I hope the guy hosting is listening. Damien. You heard it here, folks. <laughs> right. <laughs> Going to be a lot of green jello video <laughs> uh, questions tonight in the trivia. It ties wow. into 420 green. Yeah. It, you know. Yeah. And jello. Oh. I don't know. And <laughs> jelly, for that matter. <laughs> jelly, jello, all of it, man. I like it all. I think we got uh, through Thursday finally. Except for Experience Live Music Row, which we just kind of mentioned that every... Yeah. A festival every weekend down in Belleville now. Yeah, I think it's more than just the weekend. It's like... Yeah, it's Wednesday, Thursday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, Saturday and Sunday. All the bars get together. They got a sponsor. I think it's Neutral Vodka or something yeah, like that. I believe so. And all the bars get together and they book a bunch of bands and they kind of, uh, you know, stagger times and uh, promote it all as one thing. Yeah, it's Experience. been going on about a year now. At least. Yeah, yeah, genius. So, yeah, that's cool to see somebody. Uh, I mean, that's a lot to do. Do they allow yeah. golf carts? <laughs> they they do not. It is strictly so. forbidden. No, I don't know. <laughs> I think Prairie Inn and Dorsey really is the honest, only the only golf place. I, yeah. Hey, that's unique to Prairie Inn. Shuttle cart. <laughs> uh, they don't even allow. If you guys got any sponsors out there for the shuttle cart idea? You can hit me up at joshwit77 <laughs> at gmail.com. <laughs> Might try Halpa Music. Uh, or, wait, you don't uh, have a joshwit.com yet? Oh, right. oh wait. You need to get on that. <laughs> well, Justin, they don't, nobody complains about me. <laughs> hey. hey. You're, yep, he's got Josh Witt. Don't about me, man. You're right. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> he's got joshwit.net because he's got a lot of yeah, stuff oh, for sale. It's okay. .org, actually. Yeah, yeah. Hey, it just dot, occurred to me. Dot .org. Organ. Did you that three orgy. guys come in to promote a specific thing together, or why are you here? You guys asked us. <laughs> you asked okay. me. To be I, to okay, I was I, invited. I haven't heard what I, it, what the reason was. So, so. I, I I invited these three okay. gentlemen, and you have already covered the reason I, I did invited it? Okay. him. It was 420. And okay. I, I called Josh and said, hey, 420's coming up. You haven't been in in a while. Let's just talk about everything you got hey, going I'm on. I'm surprised I remembered. Yeah. Let's <laughs> get a bunch of stoners in here. That's the plan? Yeah, the plan oh, was. Hey, you know we can do it again Saturday. 422. That's yes. also 420. Oh, yes. I love That's it. also I love 420. It. I love it. Uh, <laughs> I love it because it comes uh, every day of the year for me. But yeah, me too. You know. <laughs> every day is four twenty. Did you see they took down the four twenty clock from the wedge building? They did. Oh, they did. They did. And they, oh, there was, oh they, shame on they, them. They took it off, and there was an old clock underneath it, and it said four twenty two. Wow, it advanced two minutes. <laughs> <Right>. uh, <laughs> <laughs> or no, you meant also, right? <laughs> uh, Numbers. Numbers. What is going that one, on? That one was probably put there in seventy one. <laughs> right. Which seventy? I think the Waldo's probably put it there. <laughs> had stickers made. Yeah, uh, they had stickers. Where's Waldo? Save What's the it? clock tower. Oh man. <laughs> Gosh. Uh, you know they found Waldo dead in his apartment a few days ago, and people should have been asking, "How's Waldo? Not where's Waldo?" Right, right. Where's that support system for that? Yeah. Sit down, Waldo. S- sit, Waldo. Sit. Oh my gosh! I, yeah, so I, I invited him in to talk okay. about to talk about everything coming up, and one thing that we need to talk about with Billy Nelson is this weekend we got Backwoods, biggest oh, yeah. show mm. to this date that I will probably play. Yeah, Backwoods, <laughs> it is a big deal yeah, for it's me. It's a big one. Yeah, Lots. heck yeah! So you guys, uh, what which uh, which day are you playing? We're Friday? playing Sunday. Sunday, Sunday evening. Sunday. We've got a pretty good slot. Nice. What time? Eight fifteen and nine, I think. 
Ooh, after dark, so you get the light show. Yeah. Yep, it's down nice. in Mulberry Mountain in Ozark, Arkansas. Yeah. About six hours away from Pre-parties there, so. today, but I think the kickoff tomorrow at like, you know, 10 o'clock in the morning, and then it goes till Monday morning at like 6 a.m. Yeah. You got like big, gigantic lettuce, a lot string of, cheese incident. A lot nice. of St. Louis support with Colt Ball, Fleetwood and Family, yeah. Lofty's Comet right here in Alton. Yeah, heck Granite yeah. Area. So, yeah, we, we're excited, man. Heck yeah, man. Uh, at String Cheese going to be there, huh? Yeah, yeah. two yeah. nights. They're having a taco party at 2 a.m. on the stage. We're going to be Actually, correction, they changed it. They're doing it in the afternoon now, and Colt Ball got their 2 o'clock slot. Nice. Yep. Ah, so good for during Colt, the day man. so normal people can attend. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> Don't need a bunch of reptiles out at the taco party. Uh, or do we? They were like, or is, do it, we? is anybody <laughs> really going to eat tacos at 2 a.m.? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm going to tell you right now, that's about a 4 or 5 a.m. thing. Right, right, right. You know? I mean, I'll eat tacos right. any time of the day. Yeah. It's yeah. tacos. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Andy Frasco is going to be there, your buddy Andy. Oh, yeah. really? I didn't realize Frasco was going to be there. Nice. Yeah, we got nice. some Keller Williams and some. Oh, he's, he's good. Pigeons is tonight. Pigeons playing ping pong is tonight. They're probably playing right now. Yeah. That's soon. It's about that time. Yeah. So if you're in the area, it's a, you know, get on down there. Tickets are relative, and there's a lot, yeah. lot of activities. They brought the Ferris wheel out again this year. Hey, uh, three hey, stages. Three, three stages. EDM stage go. in the woods, man. <laughs> uh, so, so have you? Uh, I'm sure you've caught like Keller and seen that dude just. Oh yeah. Did play 43 instruments mm. while you go in oh, 17 like, different bands. Was, yeah. Oh, what's like, he yeah. doing, man? He's in every band. <laughs> right. Oh, we've seen him with the string uh, dusters and. Uh, oh, Nice. Over here at the old rock house, and he came out about three quarters of the way through their set, and they did a Tom Petty tribute. Yeah. And then, Suddenly, and, the string dusters were infamous. Yeah, and as he suddenly, walked out. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's like, "Who's uh, this?" Oh, well, that's Keller. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that dude's insane, man. Uh, and leftover salmon. That was awesome. Oh, leftover show. salmon. Those guys. I, I tell you what. That's out of all the out of everything that's happened at the amphitheater down here since it's been built in Alton. Leftover salmon's probably been my favorite show that's happened down there. Uh, that was a uh, that was a great uh, great show. Those guys are always good. Uh, Vince and the boys. Uh, you seen Frasco? I have not yep. caught him. Okay, you, you got to catch it, man. Have you oh, yeah. seen Vince Herman and Andy Frasco's yes. YouTube Co- video of yeah. cooking on yeah. psychedelics? I, I talked to. Uh, it's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, I talked talked to Frasco about that right after it happened, and I and uh, I'm like, dude, like, whose idea was this? He goes, well, it was my idea, but as soon as I said it to Vince, hey, let's eat mushrooms while we do a cooking show. <laughs> uh, he's like, yeah, let's do that now. <laughs> yep. Let's do it right now. Did uh, you talk about that in the interview you did with him? Yeah, that's, that's, yeah, that was talked on, about on the interview yeah. uh, on the station. Out of work, yeah. Right, yeah. So there you go. He was on Riverbend Talent. Yeah, Fra- Andy Frasco was on the show. I forgot yeah. about that. Apparently he's got the mayor, and he's holding the mayor hostage. Yep. Mayor Marv? It, it, no. no. Oh. <laughs> mayor from, uh, the, he took it from Marv's house, I think. The or left no, Vince's o- house, I'm sorry. The, the, the mayor. Left o- leftover salmon's got that big, like, cheeseburger-looking mascot or whatever. Oh, yeah? And he stole it. <laughs> and he's got it out on the road with him. And everybody's like, return to mayor. <laughs> mayor McCheese. <laughs> and he's like, I'm holding yep. it. Yeah, Mayor McCheese, yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, me and him used to have the same doctor, and I'd always think, how are you alive? And your face is a burger. Like, I don't even know. I'd see him in the waiting room and just things would go through my mind. I don't know. Right. <laughs> Big Mac sauce. <laughs> oh, it's special sauce. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, so who else Who else is on the backwoods? Anybody else you can think of that's... I mean, there's, there's yeah. like A 55 lot. bands. I mean, I know the list that goes on Papa forever. Right the Polish Ambassadors. Yeah. Uh, Neighbor, they're pretty good. Son Squabby's pretty good. Spilly Nelson. Yeah, Spilly Nelson. Yeah, Spilly that's what I've been waiting to hear. Hey, Mikey Cyrus. Oh. That, that's Miley Cyrus' uh, little brother. A strange, no, a strange little brother. He was never in like the documentaries or anything. They, like, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> he was a conjoined twin. He that was they from cut like off. East Outer Space or something. <laughs> <laughs> Born in East Outer Space, man. So uh, I need so. some clarity on the name story i was just thinking about this are we being spilly nelsons or was that guy that came in last night and was like you know acting out yeah. was he a spilly nelson no 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 spilly nelson is a. Uh, uh it's def- a good acting out a then. Good, good okay thing. Yeah, yeah yeah just wanted sure. to clarify that yeah no that guy uh that guy was a uh 
a messy Nelson. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because that is the name origin, right, from partying, just like 420, right? right? Somebody made, made stickers. stickers. <laughs> you made stickers. <laughs> Jinx, show me some coke. <laughs> oh, right. Wait. Wait. I just, yeah. Jinx, show me a Coca-Cola. Whatever. I don't know what's going on. Right. Right. I, I don't know the sayings. I'm not hip to the kids' lingo from the 1970s. There's, there's two of them, you know. Yeah. But that oh, is geez. y'all's lingo, right? Yeah. Spilling Nelson. Spilling Nelson. Yeah, 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 for sure. Um, you know, it's just, you know, it's fun. How righteous on 420. It just, it's stuck. It did. Yeah. And I always, people call us Spilly anyway. They kind of just leave the Nelson out. A lot, some True. people call us Spilly Nelson. But I always told the, the guys, I'm like, if Willie Nelson ever did send us a cease and desist, it's like, we'd just be Spilly. We'd have new stickers made. Can't do it. <laughs> Ask Green Jello. We actually don't have to make new ones. We could just cut the Nelson off. We can, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, Green Jello proved it. Green Jelly. They you can't just be, spilly on jelly. You should just be spilly jelly. Yeah. Spilly <laughs> jello. Wait, they didn't do spilly jello, did they? Uh, <laughs> no, no, there was no spilly jello. You could be that all day long. It's kind of hard to spill jello if you think about it. It is kind of hard to it spill. It doesn't jello. run out. You really the... drop jello. Now, me, I could spill a pudding pop. You, can spill jello, you, right? you can't really pour it out. Yeah, because it's a solid ish, kind of. It becomes a solid. Oh, uh, dude, I don't yeah. know, man. It's kind of solid, but not like I was swimming one time on 419 and it felt like I was in jello. Swim in a pool and, of green jello. Oh, yeah, dude. I always wanted a pool full of green jello. I, I'd like to do Orbeez. A pool full of Orbeez. Oh, I won't eat at Orbeez. I used to eat at Orbeez. <laughs> oh my God. I got a franchise at Pensacola when I was working There's there. There's too much garlic in the sauce. It gives me indigestion. Oh, <laughs> you said no salt. Oh, I, I am not sure what's happening right now. Mm. I, <laughs> We've been going we all since know that guy. We all know that guy. I am that guy. <laughs> well, Pigpen, we're sponsored by Howe Music Company and by Mr. Matt Van Voorhis of Macias Insurance. And Spilly Nelson, they have an open mic night every Wednesday night at the yes. conservatory. So now you know what we're doing. We're here talking about that. There's also oh, yeah, an open yeah. mic uh, tomorrow night. Yeah. Uh, Trinity's Way open mic. Not even at night. Afternoon, we're talking. Yeah, it is about. afternoon. Four Where's to eight. At? Good start. Mavis, right? Four to eight p.m. Mavis. Coffee. Hey, I got a gift certificate for there. That'd be there a good go. time to use it. Four there o'clock. It starts. Four p.m. Kickoff and, time. And Justin, yeah. I hear Ian's record is really cool. Uh, it is. I've been lucky enough to sit in on a couple of mixing sessions with what he's been doing so far, and it sounds great. And but, from what I know, he's put together a band, so he's going to be gigging nice. this record here pretty soon. Now, we are so, talking so about, for the listeners, Ian Whitmore. Ian Whitmore, yes. Right? Yep. Who who has his own beans at Mavis Coffee, just to tie everything yeah, in. Yeah, fabulous right? roaster. Go, right. check, go check his stuff Check out. that out, Spilly. Yes. I got roasted with him. A, yeah. man, a man with his own beans. He roasts me all the time. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, you look terrible. I'm like, thank you, Ian. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Worst roast ever. <laughs> you look pretty okay tonight. <laughs> his beans are better. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, yeah, yeah. Ian, Ian's got a new album out. Yeah, coming out soon. I believe so. I think he's trying to have it out in the next month or two. Yeah. I'm not sp- nice. sure on a specific All date, the recording done then? and uh, All the recording's done as far as I know. I think they're in the last stages of the mixing, maybe even on to the mastering now. Nice. What about Spilly? You guys planning anything like oh, that? Yeah. Yeah, we're still in the writing stages, but okay. we're getting we're getting there. You okay. know, we've we got just, an album, a whole album worth of stuff ready. We just haven't recorded it yet. We're just trying to you know work out some of the honing details. out the yeah. honing out the kinks. You know. However, if you catch any of our sets recently, you, there you will hear a few new ones in nice. the set. So one of them is about four twenty. It is cool. It's called Dude. Lifted. Yeah. No, it's not. It's called The Wall. Those be lifted. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's actually it was lo- we had to shorten it so it would fit on the cassette. Smoking marijuana. Smoking marijuana. Smoking marijuana. So me much lifted. room on that cassette, you know what I mean? I think it's actually <laughs> so 420, 420 Waldos1971.com. I'm pretty sure that's for real. I'm yeah. not making that backslash up. Justin Hold on, hold on. Is that, <laughs> is that, is that another <laughs> complaint department? Is that just yeah. ni- is that 1971 that's or 1971s? Where get, that's that's where you get the yeah. vape. That's, on there. <laughs> that's where you get the vape <laughs> pen. And you support the Drug Policy Alliance. I, I, I support everything. <laughs> so you're a jockstrap. 
I when I have to be, <laughs> when, when, when that's what the gig is. <laughs> you know, you do look pretty okay today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, looking better all the time, aren't I? Now that you know there's options. <laughs> so some hideous gentlemen tomorrow night at the conservatory. Yes. That's right. That's right. They're going to be there tomorrow night. Um, every uh, every third uh, every third Friday. Jesus, every third Friday of the month. Yes, my child. Yep. Don't don't go blaming him. Huh? Don't go blaming him. Oh, you're right. I can blame him for a lot of other things. You're right. <laughs> so wait a minute. But not it's, this. But not that. No, um, no, it's it's great. Um, they always mix it up. So sometimes they come in and uh, they'll just do, like Rob and Jared will just do an acoustic thing. Sometimes it's full band. Sometimes they'll bring other folks in with them and just have like a big super jam type of situation. Nice. But yes, Hideous Gentlemen. Uh, third Friday of every month. And if you're a fan of Hideous Gentlemen, go I check am. out Jared's shop next door to the next Conservatory, door, yeah. Alton Music Exchange. Yeah. And, and, and check out their videos. Yeah. Because they got yeah, a couple sure. of really cool videos uh, on Shot at the Conservatory, one of them was. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And, and uh, really uh, a couple of cool ones it's there. So uh, check them out. So Nice. Is- Hideous Gentlemen, tomorrow night at the Conservatory until like 1130, right? That's about when we try yeah, to man. shoot for yeah. Sometimes it, we'll go a little bit longer if people are really feeling it. Is, is it is it Spilly Gentleman or Hideous Nelson? That's it's it. The, it is the okay. So Mike Snyder, give it up for Mr. Yeah, Mike right, Snyder, I, right from last year. Uh, Mike at at, at Framley, that family, he built that guy, that guy, and we named him the Spilliest Gentleman because the Spilliest Gentleman because there it was it us and Hideous no, playing. Yeah, I so, couldn't remember if it was the uh, the. Sp- Spilly gentleman or it's, hideous? It's the spilly, Nelson's, spilliest yeah, gentleman. The spilliest gentleman, yeah. yeah. I and, imagine and, all you folks are there on Wednesday night, though, right? For the open mic, hideous and spilly. Uh, they nice. come, we'll, they we'll get, get them once yeah. yeah. Matter of yeah. fact, they practice on Wednesday nights next door in the basement, nice. so they'll pop over when they're finished. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got you. Nice. Yep, Just we so a, folks know. We got a lot of a lot of regulars, you know, yep. like like Steph. And, and Fred and yeah. and Lago and Cosmo, you're listening in right now. Give it up, for Cosmo. Hey, hey Cosmo. Cosmo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. uh, but yeah, Come there's a lot of regulars, yeah, a lot of good people that show show up. You know, they support, and that we want to keep there seeing that. Right on. Party buns. That's a band name. <laughs> Party buns. Yeah. All right. They're playing at the lodge at Lovejoy Party on buns. Friday night. All right. Party I'm buns. Down, I'm down for some party buns. What else? Bearded Bandits at Fast City with uh, Exit 52. There's more numbers. Fast City. Town Criers at Sports Tap. And uh, they're booking Friday nights. Sports Tap is? Yeah. Okay. 618-465-2539. Call them up. They're wanting to book up their Fridays all summer long. There you go. So some beach volleyball and Spilly Nelson. Yeah. Oh, man, it seems That would be cool. Yeah, it, se- it does. It seems all right. Uh, so... What else we got going on? Uh, Trag tomorrow? Band. Trag Dude. Band at the BFW. Doppelganger yep. out at Bakers and Hale and Godfrey. Everheart and Light at the Moose and Wood River. Borderline uh, playing at the VFW and Wood River, if you're lucky enough to get in. <laughs> Toxic Johnny. They're sold out the next night. Uh, again, yeah. 3 to 7 at uh, the Lakeside Marina Bar, Toxic Johnny, on uh, Friday night. The Hillbenders. They present Who Grass. 8 p.m. at the Wild what is it like Theater. It's called the Who? It's Who Bluegrass. Bluegrass. <laughs> nice. That's cool. And they're the Hillbenders. Nice. Yeah, at the Wild E. Man, I just seen Cornfish walk in the studio. I don't know yeah. if you guys know yeah. Cornfish. Hey, he's, he's, Cornfish. Here, he's here to. Mr. Sam McKinney. Yeah, we're going to record a little interview with him right after the right show's on. over. on. Yeah. He's part of the crew, man. He's family. Absolutely, you know? yeah. Absolutely. We got the uh, Vixen drag show uh, at the uh, back bar on Friday. Paul Niehaus at the Stagger Inn. Paul Niehaus. Is that four? There's a number. Or is that six? I, Which way do you do your Roman, Roman numerals? If it's one, that, B. That, that is a four. Okay. That is a four. Trivia night at the conservatory tonight. It'll be part of the question. Yeah. Beth Bombara at the Chop House in Edwardsville Friday. And uh, Reese's Brewing is closing. And they're going to turn it over to uh, some hamburger folks. Heard about that. Yeah. Yeah, that's... Tyler and uh, Casey from Sneaky Burgers in Edwardsville are going to be taking that place over. All right. Soul Shine Groove at the Moose in Edwardsville. Double Y Duo at the Cabin at Judy Creek in Glen Carbon. Lanny and Julie at the Elks in Granite City. Classic Crush at Patrick's in Granite City. Uh, Dueling Pianos and Comedy Showcase. 
down at Tegan's Pub House in Granite City. That's Jeremy, uh, how do you say that, Gernon? And uh, Jaywash, who plays down at uh, Rage Cajun quite a bit. Decades Apart at Doid's Village Inn in Pontoon Beach. And uh, here's this uh, ticket thing I was uh, mentioning to you, Pigpen. Kind of read through that. Down at the Old Herald Brewery, here's a ticketed show, and here's how they're doing it, at least for this show. All right. So it's the Fry Project. Yeah. 6.30 to 9.30. All right. Tickets range from $15 to $75. All right. Okay. Hmm. And let's see. You get a reserve seat. With the first beverage for fifteen, uh, the Cold Herald Rooftop Lounge is a thirty dollar ticket. All right. Dinner reservations for four. Reserve your table, four till service dinner, right, and beverages. Uh, great view of the show. Tickets include ten percent off food beverages. Table will be available starting two hours before show begins. But here's the part I think might become a problem. All right. Please arrive by start of show, as any no-show seating will be offered to other guests after the show begins. So if you're running wow. late. Yeah. you're you're. It's a pretty decent policy, actually. Yeah. yeah. I get it. But at the same time, someone's going to get angry. <laughs> yeah. I'm if running you... late. That's not my fault. Right. Yeah. yeah. Don't don't well, run late. Well, now you sit in the back. That's what yeah. that's what the deal don't, is. Don't run late. That's the key. All right. That's the lesson learned. There's here. a forty dollar VIP Sheesh. with beverage service. All right. And uh, well, there you go. Yeah. So lots of different ticket prices on that yeah. one. Okay. What else is going on Friday night? Uh, Steve Mellis up at the uh, Hog Pit. John Evans at George's Local Brew in yeah. Jerseyville. Scott Marlin at the Rustic in Warden. Uh, 1055, more numbers. They're going to be at Martin's Lanes and Root House. <laughs> and uh, here's a original show with uh, a past guest, right? Help me read that, Pigpen, because my, my eyes are bad. Obviously offbeat release show. Uh, mm -hmm. Banks and Cathedrals and Crystal Lady. Right. So there you go. Crystal Lady's been on the show right, with us yeah, in the that's past. So that's the uh, heavy anchor in St. Louis. All right. So there you go. There's a Friday night. That, that, is, that is quite Saturday's the Friday evening. insane because Grafton's open again. <clears throat> so, yeah, all the Grafton shows going on. Yeah. And uh, that Borderline show I told you was sold out was for charity. They're playing down at uh, Julie's Banquet Center. And that's the uh, Kelsey's Hope Foundation. They grant wishes to people. And they granted a wish to uh, Michael Lemons before he passed. Uh, he got to skydive, and Michael Lemons had cancer. So congrats again to Borderline for selling out another show. It's three shows now we mentioned they've sold out. Well, And they, they're for charity. That's even cooler. When you put out a Facebook post that gets 160,000 <laughs> you know, likes or whatever, I, I guess you're going to sell out some shows. Oh, I, yeah. I'm still baffled as to how they did that. Cross the line, do on exit 52 on Saturday at Fast Eddie's. Uh, let's see. Rock Crown is playing first for the Riverbend Records record day. They play from noon until 1.30. Then, what does that say? Lexi, Don's, 2 to 4. I'm doing this Lexi, without glasses. Lexi, Don, at 2 to 4 p.m. And then Paper Boulders, 4.30 to yeah. 6 p.m. That's all at Riverbend Records on Saturday. Also Saturday at Bakers and Hale, we got here for now from 7 to 10 p.m. Flip the Frog will be at Doc's. Holidays, Doc Holidays in uh, Cottage Hills, 8.30 on Saturday. Audio Distilled, Hallelujah Lily, 4 to 7 p.m. That's the Blue Stem Vodka in Meadowbrook. Mm. Incognito, 9 p.m. at the Pump House on Saturday. Spanky and the gang down at Martin's Tunes and Eats from 6 to 10. Alfalfa singing that? I Probably. I, 15 maybe, bucks, he better Maybe. Be. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Sonic Tonic at the Hog Pit uh, on Saturday, 2 p.m. Tanglefoot, 3 to 6 at the Loading Dock. Terry Beck, 3 to 7 at the Grafton Winery. Cabin Fever, 2 to 6 at Grafton Pub. They were going to have their grand opening tonight at Grafton Pub, but they moved that because of the weather to yeah. tomorrow night. So. There's, there's a lot of Grafton stuff happening here. Jim on Keys at Aries. Uh, 1 to 5 on Saturday, Bob Gleason, 7 to 10 at the Bloody Bucket Saloon 
Outlaw Opry at the uh, Oyster Bar in Grafton, 7 to 11. That's a lot of stuff going on in Grafton on Saturday. Yeah, moving on to Holiday Shores in Edwardsville. Cricket in the Grilled Avocados from 8 p.m. until midnight at Wigglers. You guys have done Wigglers. We, we love have. Wigglers. Yeah. yeah. Matter of fact, we'll be there for their Halloween party this year. Yeah. Right. Nice. They got that little nice. patio and mm-hmm. nice and a jam out there, huh? Mm-hmm. Lane and Julie, uh, double gig, 2 to 5 at the Foundry and then across the street from 7 to 10 at the Corner Tavern in Edwardsville. Thunderstruck, ACDC tribute, obviously, 8 o'clock at the Wild E Theater. Uh, the Hangovers and Grand Arson, 9 o'clock at the Back Bar in Edwardsville. That's some original music at the Back Bar. We love that. Nice. Spencer McDowell at the Stagger Inn Saturday. Butch Moore, catch him before he leaves town. He's heading to Ireland. Oh, wow. Yeah. Viva La Fiesta is where he'll be playing from 5 to 9 in Edwardsville. And then the uh, Global Brew Spring Fest happening uh, this weekend, Saturday. Blake Foltz, 11 to 2. Mike Sonderegger, 2 to 5. And Robert Perry and the Mojos, 5 to 8 at the City Park in Edwardsville. Scott Marlin at Lyle's Tavern in Maryville. Midlife duo at the cabin at Judy Creek. Uh, What's that one? Dr. Martin's Flannel Brigade <laughs> slash Chili uh, Camino. Right. Chili Camino. Yeah. That's oh, at Patty wow. McDee's, 8 o'clock in Grand <laughs> City on Saturday. Your buddy Scruffy looking nerve herder. <laughs> love it. Yep. Love it. I love the name. Great name. name. Yeah. Who's my nerve herder? He's playing, a place, <laughs> he's playing a place called Manhattan's Coffee Shop. We haven't had that one on in Granite City from 7 to 10 nice. on Saturday. Nice. Oh, man, look at that. You take over. It just right? keeps going. Decades yeah. apart, 8 to uh, We're getting close. after midnight at Deutz Village Inn on Saturday. And then a Leonard Skinner tribute, Legend 77, with special guest Jeremiah Johnson. That's at the Miners Theater in Collinsville mm-hmm. uh, Saturday. WSIE The Sounds presents Howard Street. That's at the old Herald in Collinsville Saturday. American a- Slang, Prairie Inn in Dorsey. Got the Music City Row going on way out in Belleville. And then here's a good one, Pops. Uh, uh, local showcase featuring Isabella, New Lingo, Oakwood Grove, Cold Rooms, and a great band called Unknown and Sailing. The so. crazy guys. Oh, yeah. There you go. I met those dudes at the first Framley Fest. They camped right next to us. Yeah, yeah. that is my godson. Who wants a beer? And I just seen Alex's head pop out of the tent. He goes, beer? <laughs> <laughs> I've made friends since then. Oh, yeah. A whole bunch oh, yeah. more you can find at cottonmouth.org. We'll just leave it yeah, at that. Yeah, there's just a ton a ton going on. That pretty much weekend. is the close stuff Saturday. There's yeah. some Mike Judy action going down Saturday on there in yeah. the Experience Live row. Right. Music yeah. row. And, and the uh, third annual Rock for Brett. Oh, yeah, that's right. At the uh, Torchlight uh, Parade. We almost forgot about yeah, that. Yeah, the Torchlight Parade. Our guest from last week. Red, White, and Floyd and uh, Jojo Matea. Which brings me to this shirt that Flip the Frog gave me. I thought it was awful ironic that our last two guests had hearses involved. Yeah, we had, we had the about... morticians last week, Torchlight Parade. Yeah. Raising money for uh, Brett, right? Yeah. Cancer. And then we had Flip the Frog, who gave us a shirt with a hearse with on it. With a hearse on it, yeah. So. Wow. Synchronicity. It's folks. getting dark. Yeah. It's getting dark in here. So, yeah. It is getting dark, probably because <laughs> of a storm coming. Uh, it's got nothing to do with what we're talking about. It's just getting dark. Uh, so there you go. That's a lot of stuff going on this weekend. Everybody, don't don't act like there's not things going on. There is yeah. a ton going on, including the Backwoods Festival down in Arkansas. Yeah. Yeah. Spilling Nelson heading yeah, down buddy, there yeah. uh, right after the show, probably or you're, you're probably not right after the show. You first we're gonna you know. Get ready for the road trip. We've got a safety meeting after the Safety show. meeting, yep, yep, right. Yep. Everybody's got to get their safety vest straight. And uh, I'm going to earn a few badges for mine tonight. I don't, <laughs> I don't know if we do that in this club. But we, don't, we don't get to have stickers. We like frilly toothpicks that. in this club. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hey, finally, something I can get down on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, not only so. not only two pieces of bread, but one more piece of bread. <laughs> Just <laughs> one more. Uh, so there you go. You guys heading down to Backwoods for the for the weekend, and then uh, you say you got uh, Deutz Village Inn on what day? Yep, twenty eighth. Twenty eighth. Yeah, I believe so. Yeah. Uh, Prairie Inn in August. Dorsey. Bring your golf cart. Sixth or fifth. The twenty eighth is Deutz. That's that's next Friday. Yeah, and then um, that's an evening show, right? Yeah, that'll be from 8.30 to 12.30. 8.30 to 12 at Deutz uh, next Friday, the 28th. And then um, Sunday on May 7th, 2 to 6, come get you some lunch, Prairie, and bring your golf cart. Yeah. <laughs> bring the golf cart. Apparently decorate them. 
Right. right. I'm, oh, I'm saying go for it. Yeah. And then uh, we we didn't mention uh, uh, Trinity Fest though. Right. Yeah. Okay. We should. Yeah. Absolutely. We are headlining Trinity Fest right. on Saturday. There Saturday. you go. There you go. You guys are closing out Saturday. Too. Yeah. Campsville. It, it is in Campsville, Illinois, at the uh, McCulley yep. Project yep. something. Or, I forget Center the name. Yeah. Camping. Uh, June second to fourth. June second to the fourth, and that is uh, up in uh, Campsville, which is way up the river road yeah, there. Yeah, it's and, up and it's, uh, You can camp in yeah, absolutely camping camping. Campsville. Yeah, this will be uh, the first Trinity with camping. Nice. So yep. yeah, it will be. That's We're right. Honored. Is, yeah, yeah. Yep. absolutely. That's gonna. That's fun. Yep. For a good cause. I will be there. Yeah, buddy. We'll see you there. <laughs> I would imagine you will be. Will so, you have them headphones on? I hope. <laughs> yeah. these, these are just to protect myself from hurting my own right. ears. This is alternative for a helmet. Yeah. just didn't want to look so obvious. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> I'm trying to look cool over here. Thanks for blowing my cover. <laughs> So there you go. That's uh, what else? Anything else on Spilly Nelson's uh, horizon? I mean, up? once a month, keep uh, keep your eyes on our event page. But once yeah. a month, we're going to be at Deutz, yeah. and then once a month, we're going to be at Prairie Inn. So we got the residency. Well, there. And, and and coming up this summer, you got some other festivals you're going to be at. Oh yeah, of course, uh, Happy Trails. You're going to be at Happy Mr. Trails. Marshall, you're you're going to be at. Uh, you're going to be at uh, uh, Mo Root. Yeah, mm, maybe. Maybe I haven't announced the lineup yet, but we'll see. Yeah. Yes, yeah, I mean we I would imagine. Yeah, I figure you. The way to go, Josh. I'm, I'm guessing. Think positive. Yeah. I'm, I, I, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and say that you're going to be there. Manifest right. it. I mean, right. I'm going to go regardless. Man. Right, <laughs> I'll be there regardless. Uh, cool. Uh, uh, any other ones you can think of? You're going to be at? Uh, we're probably, probably play, some more though. Yeah. We're probably going to play at the conservatory sometime this summer. I would imagine too. Yeah. Man. We <laughs> love that place. <laughs> Justin in the house. He also is. Uh, he also is a very good guy with levels. <laughs> hey, that's yeah. my name. He's on the level. He is hey, on the level. On the hey, level. Dude, that's hey, my hey, there's guy level right head, there. then there's <laughs> Justin level. Don't touch my knob, right, brother? <laughs> yeah. yeah got, look what I'm doing to his knob right here in front of you. Get out of here. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that one didn't kill as much as hey, Stone you know what, Depot. Dude, I don't get Stone to Depot. Make jokes. All right. Uh, no, that was great. That was that like, was a good one. Good show. Yeah, uh, so I agree. That was, even that was definitely the yeah, Cosmo yeah. message. That was, that, was <laughs> our, that was our apex for that sure. Was our apex. Yeah. Right. All right, so, there you go. So, uh, so, my next so, bar. so down at the conservatory right now, we got trivia. Trivia, yeah, trivia. coming starting up. Starting at seven thirty. Starting at seven thirty. Remember, yeah. Stone Tomorrow. Depot is an answer. Yes. To one of the questions. Yes. Uh, okay. Also, so trivia one. Trivia tonight. Hideous gentlemen tomorrow on Friday. And then on Saturday, we've got the return of Humans and Strangers, uh, and Claudia Rose is going to be opening that show. All right. So if you're in the area, come by and check it out. And it's cool. and it's 1492, what? not 1692. Right. Fort right. when Columbus came over. Right. Unfortunately, I that's what they try to teach us. 1692 yeah, like, is actually really 200 years later. Look, I can't pay six. <laughs> I can't pay no 1692. I spaced it. You know, what can I say? Hey, it's all a lie, anyways. What's the right? All, right. <laughs> I don't like all I these mean, numbers. I find it oppressive. <laughs> I mean, according to uh, some religions, we're only what a thousand years old. The planet. Uh, yeah, to some of them. Right. Some of them, not even that much. Like, right. like, according to like. What I've been reading, like seventy years, seventy-two, seventy-one years. 70, that's it. That's <laughs> which, 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 which one though? Is uh, it the third? Or it's the, the third seventy yeah. oh, yeah. well, If you believe in the multiverse, it's all of them. I don't think exactly. we should get into what I read. She thinks the writers so from smart. Family Guy believe in the multiverse. That's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> this is a great episode. This is probably one of their best episodes. <laughs> yeah, the multiverse episode. So good. Uh, so, all right, man. Well, everybody, uh, thanks uh, for coming down, Josh Witt. Andrew, for, you guys for have to pee. You guys appreciate you. Hmm? You guys are moving out fast. You got to pee. They got better places. We're to gonna be. go pee. Together. I'm ready for this safety meeting. <laughs> yeah, okay. safety meeting. So it is. Uh, thanks to Spilly Nelson. Get get out and check those guys out. Big thanks to my buddy Justin Little. Thanks very down. much, guys. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for thanks down. for having us back. Much continued success with you, all your adventures. Thank you very much. Yep, and everybody, appreciate you guys. Everybody, get out. Hold there. on one second. Yeah. One yeah. second. One yeah. more thing. Yeah, we got to say rest in peace to the Great Dane. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. My buddy Durs. Yep, had to put my buddy Durs down today. Uh, uh, rest in peace, Durs. Uh, yeah. He was a great dog, man. You probably, most of you have met him. Yep. And uh, so, yeah, man. Hug yeah. your loved ones and say a prayer. That's there right. you go, man. All right. Everybody Way get out there and on support. A bummer, man. No, no. We're going to end on a good note, and that is to remind everyone to support local music and art. And cannabis.